Most pickers find it easiest to learn songs with which they are very familiar with the melody. Many of us grew up hearing Christmas carols like these thousands of times. In this video we'll show you how to play the melody to each of these songs. And we'll give you a practice track so you can play along. Many of my students struggle with melodic style picking because they're trying to learn songs like Blackberry Blossom or Turkey in the Straw. These songs are played at a slower tempo and even though they're in the melodic style, they are relatively easy to play. Here's what is referred to as the melodic scale. It simply is the Do Re Mi played in this position. In this pattern, notice I had finger one on fret four all the way up to my pinky on fret seven. These Christmas carols are played slowly enough that you could actually cheat on your fingering in both the right and left hand. It's just a matter of trying to get familiar with where the melody notes will be found. Let's now take a look at how this scale pattern helps you learn the song The First Noel. The song begins on B3 and it's in 3-4 times, so you would count 1, 2, and a couple things to note, there is a dotted quarter note, that's a longer note, and then the little squiggle is a rest sign. You will be asked to move from frets 5 and 4 up to 9 and 10, just take fingers 1 and 2 and move them up there. Here now is a play along track for the first Noel. All three of these songs will be performed at 120 beats per minute, which is on the slower side of tempos. You can even slow it down further should you need to by using the YouTube settings. Deck the Halls plays out of the same position, frets 4 to 7. There's a spot where you'll need to move your middle finger over to string 2 to catch this quick series of notes. Notice my first finger went all the way down to string 4, fret 4. Toward the end we'll need to play four of the same note consecutively. We'll do that by doing the thumb index thumb index. Just a quick mention that all of these songs can be found in my Holiday Classics banjo book and there's information down in the video description that tells you how to order it. Here now is a practice track for Deck the Halls. It Came Upon a Midnight Clear is back in 3-4 time. It's in the key of C rather than the key of G, but the notes are still found in this same position. In fact, you have no notes on the first string, so if you want to cheat your first finger over to the fifth fret and do the seventh with your third finger, you can do that. This is the first of our three songs that has a fill in it, and it simply is going to be a roll that we insert. About halfway through, we're going to move out of position, go down here to the first position. On the 
On this play along track, you'll notice there's some chords. So if you have a friend that plays guitar or organ, they can be backing you up. And in fact, here's our backing track and you'll hear the organ in this. <laughs> 